Now, SpaceX's Falcon Heavy Center Core booster is back at Port Canaveral. After a little trouble at sea, the booster tipped over after landing on a drone ship following last week's launch. News 6's James Barbero is at Port Canaveral with the details. This afternoon, we wait for a Port Canaveral crane to raise the toppled Falcon Heavy booster, the center core of the most powerful rocket in the world, falling over during a rough return to the port on the high seas. New 6 is told SpaceX will potentially only be able to reuse the booster's nine engines. Elon Musk's company will analyze the debris to determine the wear and tear. Did you hear what happened to the booster? It seems yeah. to have had a rough trip back. Fell over. Things happened. They did their best and it made out well anyway. Some guests at the port see it as a learning experience for SpaceX. They win some and lose some. That's all. all right. It's exciting. It's, it's incredible. Other tourists, like these friends from the Midwest, weren't in town for last week's launch, so any chance to see the rocket at all is a thrill. I can't wait to go pick it up. I just came down to for Florida for, for some sun and fun, not, but I'm getting a great education and a history in the making. Falcon Heavy made history indeed. Last Thursday, in its second flight, SpaceX successfully landed all three rocket boosters. The side boosters at Cape Canaveral, the center booster here at the port today, on the drone ship in the ocean. The recovered side boosters will fly again on a future SpaceX mission. About the center booster, we do not have word from the port right now when exactly SpaceX will raise it. At Port Canaveral, I'm James Sparvero, getting results news 6.